Welcome back to the channel guys, Crypto Lightsaber back again with another video and today is a very sad day in crypto, at least in Tweeba. Tweeba has fallen from the very top, about 84 cents, it fell all the way down to about 82 cents guys, this is crazy, alright? A lot of comments coming about that, got friends ringing me, uh, what happened to Twee and so on, alright guys? I am with those who made losses on this. Um, I mean, I'm still holding at the moment, so I haven't realized any profit or loss at the moment, okay, guys, because I actually did miss this. My plan was if I saw anything different happen in this chart, I was going to be getting out swiftly. I've been give, keeping a close eye on it. Um, all up until today, I actually decided to go and start a fire in the back garden, okay? Got a new fence being put in. They took the old fence down, so I thought I'm going to do a bonfire and I'm going to burn this down and then I can just get rid of the ashes. It will save me putting a fence in the back of my car and stuff like that. Um, I actually forgot about the charts for about only, about only about an hour, guys. And then I thought, oh, let me check the charts. And as soon as I saw, I checked from my phone, I looked and Twee was down from $84. At the time, it had bounced to about $4.90. $4.90. I couldn't believe my eyes guys, I thought, oh no, what are the chances of that? The one day where I decide not to keep an eye on the chart for an hour, that happens. And these moves can happen within a few minutes guys, in less than 5-10 minutes, okay guys, you see Tweeba did drop, alright guys, it dropped all the way down, got a bounce back to around $56, $57, and now you can see he's trying to regain some ground now, alright guys, so yeah, if you didn't sell down there and you are holding... I mean, yeah, you should get some, you should recover some of your gains. I'm actually still in a profit, which is fortunate for me. Okay, I originally bought Tweeba at around $9, just under $9 originally. Then I bought some at about $10.50. About $10 I ended up getting a bit of FOMO, buying a little bit more around the $20 mark, a little bit more about the $40 mark. But I threw some of my core values out the window because I had a little bit too much capital locked up in this and uh, not locked up but a little bit too much capital invested in Tweeba and um, yeah now I'm feeling the effects of it all right guys probably about 30k down I'll let you guys know okay at the moment I'm actually uh, I'm back up obviously because you can see Tweeba is doing a bit of a recovery all right guys but yeah you got to be careful in these coins man um, a lot of people got wrecked do feel bad for those but um, yeah there is a chance that you could come back um, it's not just Twee, okay? We've seen Apple stock, for example, drop about 2.5 billion off the market. My financial advisor gave me a call this morning, uh, sorry, this afternoon. I, I spoke to him. He says he was actually going to call me this morning when he saw on the news that Apple had dropped. He was going to tell me to be careful with Twee, for example, because, you know, these things roll over into the crypto markets as well. All right, guys. He actually didn't call me, all right? And, um, yeah, I've actually... Um, you know, <laughs> it happens, guys. This is crypto. I've been there before, all right. So emotionally, I'm not that. You know, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not destroyed emotionally. Okay, I've been through some dark times in crypto, all right, guys. Even in the last crash, you saw that Bitcoin. Uh, Bitcoin crashed after the virus hit. The stock markets crashed. Everyone thought Bitcoin was just going to carry on up, and then Bitcoin crashed as well. We're seeing this come back violently right now, guys. You know, um, I need to really keep an eye on this, guys. I mean, I don't know. If I see a bounce up to here, probably around $40, $50. Uh, 50, looks about $56. We already did see a bounce to about $56, $57 um, uh, uh, previously. All right, but this is looking good, guys. I, I hope that it can recover all the way. I will be kind of getting out and taking some profits, all right, guys. Um, like I say, I am still coming out in a profit if I do get out of that. All right, but for the sake of the video, I need to uh, just let you guys know uh, about um, Spark Point as well, okay? Um, I need to kind of hurry up and get back to this chart as well, but I'll quickly just cover Spark Point for you, okay? One thing that I'm seeing on Spark Point at the moment is a descending triangle 
all right that's a bullish breakout pattern obviously if it happens we saw the adam and eve reversal pattern down here went up around 80 to 100 percent now we're seeing it consolidate in this small triangle pattern which i've only really just clocked all right guys so my advice would be to buy the breakout if it breaks out of this triangle okay we could see this kind of go to the upside all right guys not financial advice i'm not a financial advisor all right but do your own research all right and when you're invested in cryptos you know please make sure that you're making your own decisions not anyone else's decision all right if it does fall through that then you know um probably better chance better time to wait before you buy it all right but it's still going to get some cheaper spot point at that price okay guys obviously if you was to buy now front run it front run it you know there's a high chance that it's going to break out of that triangle but we have to wait and see i could be wrong all right guys so don't take it as the absolute truth okay it's a probability all right i think it probably will all right guys i don't know the future don't ask me if spark point is going to be 50 cents by the end of september like some of you have okay i don't know all right and don't be offended when i say that i don't know either okay i cannot tell the future all right guys so yeah that's spark point okay so just a quick one on spark point you know sorry i can't give you more than that all right guys but yeah for the twee bag holders all right be extremely careful okay guys because oh this is bouncing back violently guys this is bouncing back violently guys okay i think i might take some profit on twee okay yeah rather be safe than sorry at this point guys could have sold a little bit early there but yeah that's the way it is guys sometimes in crypto you gotta do what you gotta do get out and uh, be safe all right guys so yeah that's it for now if you're not subscribed to the channel subscribe like leave a comment down below let me know what you think guys you know let me know how you're getting on whether you're still holding twee bags okay and i will see you guys in the next video